Hey YouTube, just wanted to make a quick video. This is J-Rod. Um, if you're looking to buy ammo, you're looking to buy some magazines. If you're even looking to buy a new gun, a new rifle, an AK, an AR, now is the time to buy. Now is the time to buy because prices are pretty much dropping. Some prices are pretty much getting back to normal somewhat weight and uh just depends where you buy from and um as for ammo and magazines and everything goes right now is being considered the good old days <laughs> especially we're over the uh post uh, sandy hook uh era of when everybody was uh you know, shitting on each other and trying to profit from ammo and and all types of uh, firearms and stuff, trying to double up the prices and uh, profit from all the shit that was going on from, uh, you know, Sandy Hook and all the hysteria with uh, our president and stuff, you know. And then, you know, the dry up of the ammo and stuff like that couldn't find no damn ammo at, at Walmart. Um, to be honest with you, a shotgun is a good weapon as well. When Sandy Hook, after Sandy Hook happened and all the ammo dried up, um, there was a lot of shotgun ammo still available. So uh, that's one uh, weapon I suggest you should always have a shotgun, at least in the house or something. 12 gauge, 20 gauge, doesn't matter. Other than that, folks, um, you know, even if you don't got no money to blow, at least buy a box or two every month, something, you know, just to keep in the stash, just to keep away, or, you know, if you're looking to make a trip to the range, at least keep a box or two, maybe, you know, in a stash, and probably bring about, you know, a box or two, maybe three boxes to go shoot at the range. It's, it's all up to you. I'm not trying to tell you how to spend your money or whatever. But um, definitely is the time to buy now. Even our magazines, uh, AK magazines, um, the Hex Mag, which is a competitor with, uh, with all other um, AR mags. They are going for about, I think, $10.99. And they're 30 round mags, very good magazines. Um, they're actually in competition with uh, with P mags. So, and you know how P mags, they are very, very reliable. A lot of people like them. But um, other than that, folks, you know, like a, like a steel mag like this for AK, um, I must have spent about, well, I think, eight bucks for this brand new uh, used it a couple times already and uh, has a hiccup on me once this is not a a uh, Glock 30 let me see how many rounds is this 30 it's not even that clear let me go ahead and look at it about what 31 32 rounds but this is made by P Mag. I mean, I'm sorry, not P Mag. Pro Mag. <laughs> I don't know what the hell I said. P Mag. Pro Mag is made by Pro Mag, and I wouldn't trust it with my life. I just bring that to the range to plink. But other than that, guys, um, you know, I said it before. I say it again. Definitely go up, go out there and buy your ammo, stock up. If you have the money to blow, go ahead and stock up. Get your magazines, because you never know when the shit is going to blow up again. You know what I mean? Hope you guys uh, take care. Hope you take my advice. Go out there and uh, get what you need. Now that's available, now it's at good prices. And if you're looking for your first rifle, I suggest you go ahead and um, go, go out there and buy it. Uh, you could go ahead and get a uh, either build an AR and get a whole bunch of parts for the AR for for good price online or you could go ahead and buy an AR already built um, you could get a coat for about maybe a thousand flat 
maybe a little bit over a thousand, you know, including tax and everything. Um, you know, you just you just gotta shop. The prices are right, and you just gotta shop around and do your homework, and you'll find things out there that's um, very very worth it to spend your money on, very affordable. So now's the time, guys. God bless. Take care. Peace. I'm out.